In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to design 2021 calendar in Pizzle Lab. All right, so let's get started. So first off, you have to set the image size of your work. So we click on this icon, then we go to image size, and we set the width and the height to a certain value. All right, so the width will be 3508 and the height will be 4961. So make sure you set the size like this and you are good to go. All right. Now let's just delete this test over here because we don't need it for now. The next thing that we would like to do is to insert a shape. So we click on shapes and we insert this shape. Now make sure that you, you stretch the size of the shape to fit well as I am doing it. All right. So you increase the radius a bit and leave it like that. Now click on the check mark. And here you have your shape, right? You can reduce the size of it a bit and leave it here like this. Now, the next thing that you would like to do is to go ahead and change the background color of your work. So, in this case, I will select a color like this blue. After this, I will insert a picture, right? So, we we'll click on import. I got this picture from pezzles.com and I'll leave the link in the description so that you can also download it. Alright, so I'll stretch this image to cover the entire working area like this. Now what I'll do is I'll send this image to the back of the work. So I'll click on to back. Now what do I do next? The next thing is to reduce the opacity of the image a bit all right so now I'll click on a check mark i'll go ahead and lock the image at the background then after this i'll come back and select the shape that we've inserted having selected a shape i'll go and click on texture so from texture i'll insert a calendar all right i got a calendar from calendar365.com so all credit to calendar365 so let's do that quickly The next thing to do is to crop the calendar very well so that only the dates are showing but then if you want to leave the holidays inside you can choose to do that by this prayer i'm going to cut off the holidays like this so you click on a check mark and here we have it now you could see that there are parts of the calendar which is showing double and we don't want that so we we'll click on maintain ratio to enable it all right so we'll click on this and here we have it Now our calendar has been inserted successfully, alright? So we will leave it right here for now and continue with other processes as well. So now the next thing that we'll do is we we'll use the Bezier tool to come up with a shape, alright? So we click on this icon and stretch this a bit. So just follow this carefully and we go so come back and click on the plus one then we draw another shape over here now a lot of people keep complaining that after using the bezier tool they don't know how to fill inside all right so just follow me carefully and you'll be able to get that quickly so click on this icon and after that come and increase the opacity all right you can see that it has been filled already so as it's been filled this is what we're going to do we'll give it this color all right and we we'll remove the stroke to zero then we we'll click on the check mark after this you can come and stretch the image size 
alright, to your satisfaction. Then we rotate it and place it the way we want it to be. Alright, so we'll make a copy of this and change the color to blue and put it on top like this. Then we'll click the check mark. Now having done that, we'll have to lock the layers. And after that, and we'll import a picture, all right? Now having this picture over here, let's send it to the back by clicking on the back. Now the next thing that we have to do is to bring the picture to focus. So we're gonna use the arrow over here and bring the image to focus. Now let's click on the layer icon, then we bring the image on top of the first one to show clearly. Now you can go ahead and enter your test like 2021 calendar. So we enter the test over here 2021. Click on done. Click OK. Then come and select your font. Alright. So I got a font from that font.com. You can go ahead and install it. As you can, I also gave away another font in my previous video on this channel. So you can go ahead and check it out. You can have access to all of them. I use heavy tiles for this tutorial. So you just have to increase the size of the font a bit, your test for that matter. To your satisfaction. When you are cool with it, then you click on a check mark. You can make a copy of it or a duplicate of this test and write calendar. Alright. make it capitalize then reduce the size of it bring it all the way down now the next thing that we like to do if you have a logo you can go ahead and import the logo and Put it on your way all right so in this case i'll use serene arts logo all right so here we have it and i'll have to reduce the size of it so i'll click on relative size then i'll reduce the size a bit And having reduced the size, I'll change the color of it to white just to look visible on the blue background. And now if you have social media handles you can go ahead and put them on your work all right so in this case i'll put in like serene art social media handle all right Just play around this and you are good to go. Now the next thing that you want to do is to put in a social media handle around it for that matter the icon. So 
this is my facebook handle so i'll go ahead and bring in a facebook icon all right i'll use a font for it so i'll just have to type small letter f and click done go ahead to my fonts and select the social media icon fonts all right and if you and if you haven't watched my recent video i will advise you to go and watch it because i gave away this number of fonts that you can use in your designing all right so go ahead and check it out give away on 1k subs so i have the facebook icon over here as a font that will enable me to work uh, pretty good And my Instagram handle is serene ads underscore gh. But let me just put it inside right away. Serene ads underscore gh. All right, so let me just reduce the size of it as well to about seventeen. And put it on boot then bring it all the way down now the next thing I'll have to do is to make a copy of the Facebook icon that I've inserted. So I'll go to the layer panel and look for the F. Click on it and make a copy of it. Click on edit. Then I'll type in small letter L. The small letter L stands for the Instagram handle in the font meant for social media icons. So I'll bring it all the way down into the middle. Then push it closer to my Instagram handle. Alright, so you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram. Follow the, follow the page Serene Ads and you can like our page on Facebook as well. Serene Ads GH. On Instagram, we are Serene Ads underscore GH. You can go ahead and follow us. So quickly, this is how you go about designing a simple 2021 calendar and puzzle lab. So thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next video. And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel as more and more awesome tutorials are coming your way. Bless up.